right now the state website and we actually have a link Link directly to the <clears throat> site on our website. You can actually search by location. It gives you all the opportunities in your area. Each, each, so Giant has a registration portal. Adventist has a registration portal. Holy Cross has a, re a registration portal. They open up, they open up slots at different times. And you can find the information about when they open up slots on, on the respective websites. Um, and so different, different locations have different opportunities based on the, uh, based on the, who's distributing the information. Um, we're, we're trying to make it as easy as possible having that searchable link right on our website. It does link right to the state. You can put it in your area and it tells you all of the clinics that are in your immediate area. You then you can begin to, you know, look for opportunities at all of those. I think the key is, and I think the county executive described it well, um, there are very limited opportunities depending on where you go. The role of the county really is, and I think it's really important that we, we talk about this, the role of the county has really been to always be a safety net for those those who can't get opportunities through other mechanisms and so there's the link that you see goes right to the state uh, I think, thanks for sharing that once you click on that there's a searchable um, uh, by zip code uh, you scroll down slightly here and you can see it um, and you can search right there by your zip code and then you'll be able to see sites that are proximate to to your location that you may be able to get a vaccine registration for and then you'll see each of these has different opportunities and um, you'll have to go through individually each of those to to get access um, there is not a statewide all opportunity pre-registration and obviously that would be something that you know certainly the state may find helpful to do eventually but right now it is basically either through the county for the county clinics or through the individual providers um, through their various mechanisms what i want people to understand in the community is that nobody is denying them vaccine, whether it's a giant pharmacy, whether it's gonna be Kaiser, or whether it's gonna be Hopkins, or whether it's the county. All of us are gonna put out, and the county's been doing this, we're putting out every dose we can get. If you go on a site and it is locked down because all the appointments have given out, it's because all the appointments have given out, or have been given out. I can't control, none of us can control the fact that the group that's eligible far exceeds the number of vaccines we'll ever be able to do in a week. People need to understand that if it, they can't get on the schedule today, it has nothing to do with somebody not wanting to vaccinate them or you know, not being willing to operate the system. It's just they ran out of slots. It's not good. It's not happy but all of us are dealing with the vaccine limitation. And that is first and foremost why this has been so difficult. <laughs>